Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do your daily vibes for the 11th. 4 11. 4 11. Now, remember the timing is fluid, so. This may or may not be for you. Knight of Pentacles reversed. Hmm. Something may be stalled. Hmm. No movement, delay, or it has been. Hierophant reversed. Oh my goodness. There could be a lack of faith, lack of trust, lack of uh, believing. Maybe somebody, you know, I don't know. Maybe somebody could be putting a halt to something. Just saying. I'm not sure. We're going to get some more. Four of Pentacles reversed. I want to get all reversals here. Um. This is, but Four of Pentacles reverse is pretty, it's better than upright, really, because it's, it's opening up, it's, it's letting go, it's giving a little. So somebody, hmm. you know, my deck may be turned the wrong way. Two of Pentacles reversed. Somebody may have made a decision. A decision may have been made in regards to maybe moving forward with blind faith. Ah, oh, we got a good one and it's upright. Thank the Lord. This is a passionate new start, right? I think somebody has made a decision to go in a new direction. That's what it looks like to me with blind faith. I mean, this is a passionate new beginning. They may have this new spark. They got this new desire. They, they're deciding to go for it. That's what it looks like to me. I think there's been a delay. Somebody may have not had faith or, or you know, and now they're deciding to give a little. They're deciding to, you know... Go in a new direction. That's what it looks like to me. I think somebody has made a decision to go for it. Whatever it is. Five of cups and six of cups. Let's see over here. This somebody has been sulking, crying over crying over the hurt. And this you see the little angel here is like, hey, look, there's love right here. There's love right here. You know, and I think that, you know, I think that I, I feel like somebody is being brought together with somebody that, you know, they, they may have been friends with. Maybe a friendship is turning into love or something like that. Six of Cups. Maybe somebody is realizing that, you know, this is a very comfortable connection. Maybe maybe they, they think, you know, this is, I, I've known this person before. Strength. This is a soulmate connection. It is. But somebody didn't see it. There's been a delay. Somebody didn't see the connection because they were so focused on the loss. But it's like this little angel is like bringing these two people together. Asking for somebody to have faith. Now we have Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. We have Taurus here. We have Leo here. The High Priestess. Injustice reversed. I 
feel like somebody has been through a very unfair, unjustified situation, and they may have been stuck holding on to the loss, holding on to the, the emotional disappointment of it all, not really accepting an opportunity for love. They may have been clinging to some sort of memories from the past, and, and it feels as though now they, I, I think now we have somebody here that is that has been guided, you know, divinely guided to, you know, move forward to take a new approach to uh, go after what they desire I feel like somebody has been through a period of healing they may have closed themselves off for a while and they may have held their 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 goods close to their heart or they been may have been unable to open up you know for quite some time but it looks to me like somebody has found their um inner strength to master their emotions and overcome the adversity that they have been through. I think we have somebody here that has taken the time to go within to get the answers that they need and now they are making some sort of decision and it is a, it's a decision that you know has been causing them to be a little overwhelmed, okay? Somebody's had to make a over, or they have been making kind of like an overwhelming decision. They wanted to make sure that they weren't going to make a bad decision, right? I feel as though somebody may be deciding to uh, let go of a past commitment that is no more. You know, there's no more forward movement in that. It's It's come to a complete halt. And now there's an opportunity for a new partnership here. So I really feel like... We have somebody that um, has been guided for sure. That I think, you know, if you see what these two are mirroring each other, this is part of the script it's meant to be. You know, I feel like we have somebody here that sees, that knows that this, this connection, whatever connection that they're going into, it's meant to be. This is, I know, I know, you know, that this is... Uh, it's familiar to me. It makes me feel good. It's comfortable. It's love. You know, somebody, it's like, I know, I know. I think, think that somebody has come to the conclusion that, you know, this, th whoever this person is that they're coming together with, this new opportunity is... meant to be but anyhow this justice reverse this is a lack of truth somebody may have not been telling the truth we're gonna get a card to go with that somebody may not have been telling the truth they may have uh, good news is coming they may have been hiding the truth okay somebody may have been hiding the truth Maybe, maybe because their life was chaotic, because this is chaos and this is chaos, unbalanced. I feel like somebody has been through a period where their life has been really unbalanced, but I feel like somebody is definitely taking a new approach with the Page of Wands next to the Ace of Wands. I got this new idea, this new vision, you know, and I got to go for it. This is, this is a exciting opportunity here, and I feel like somebody is excited for their, for their new beginning here. Um, somebody has, it's like somebody has regained their pep, you know? I think somebody has a new suitor. They have a new suitor after being in a situation that was unfair. And I think that chapter, I, I feel like it's over. I feel like a final decision has been made, um, to focus on the future and not the past. Somebody has been anticipating, you know, what was coming. And I think whatever they've been anticipating, it's it's right here. It's right here in front of them. Um, now somebody's like, I'm ready. I'm, I'm ready. I'm, I'm going to hope for the best and I'm going to move forward in blind faith towards this, this connection that it seems to be, you know, 
maybe it's a past life relationship. You know, it's like we know each other. We're meant, you know, we know each other. You know, we, we're so in tune with each other. We, we must have known each other before. That kind of situation. <sighs> Somebody's been holding on to a false sense of security. But it's like now they just they just want happiness. Like I got I'm gonna let this crash. I'm gonna let this go and search for extreme happiness. So I really feel like we have somebody here that is letting go of a false sense of security, you know, because they've seen the light and they realize that there's an opportunity for bliss. You know, they've been enlightened through silence. I do see a period of silence here, and I think somebody has found their ability to, you know, master their emotions and go after the happiness that. You know, they have been almost like preventing, okay? Somebody has been blocking their own happiness by holding on to that false sense of security. And I feel like somebody, you know, now it's like I'm going to I'm gonna put my best foot forward and move into this with blind faith after perhaps stalling. I feel like somebody's been stalling and grieving, okay? But now, you know, they realize that this connection is is like beyond this time i'm rubbing my chest <laughs> oh god it is it's beyond this lifetime right this connection like that song thousand years by christina perry <laughs> that's what it is so um two of cups like i said i can't make it up this is a this is a this is the union that you know it's a partnership that is meant to be so I feel like two people are coming together after a uh, period of waiting or not moving forward or grieving or whatever the case is. Two people are coming together at this time. Uh, there is going to be some sort of communication that comes in. It's going to make somebody really, really, really happy. It could be an invitation. This is an invitation. You could, somebody could receive an invitation. Um, we have Leo here, we have Scorpio, we have Taurus, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, Libra, Pisces. I feel like somebody has been getting prepared to uh, step forward into a relationship and I feel like right now they're they're about really ready to, to they made a decision I think they've made a decision to go after this partnership that they know it's like they know is gonna make them very happy it's like they know this is this is it they know this is the one I know I know this is the one so I really feel like there's some, some good news coming in. There's some good communication coming in that's going to make somebody really, 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 really happy. And it's something you have been waiting for. Yeah, it's been a long time coming, but it looks like here it is. So that's that's kind of like what I got here. We are going to get some of this. It's love. It is love. It is. It's, it's a soulmate connection from the past. This is, this is something that, you know, you can't deny. It's, it's too beautiful to deny whatever it is um, finances and career financial issues are a factor in your love life right now that is where we have been <laughs> wedding this situation involves marriage I think it probably does Getting to know each other. As you reveal your innermost selves to each other, your bond deepens. So I feel like that's where we're at. I think we have two people that are about to get to know each other a whole lot better. So there could be an invite to, to get together, you know, face to face, whatever. This is what you've been waiting for. Like I said, it is what you've been waiting for. So somebody is, is about to receive some sort of invitation or message that they have absolutely been waiting for. And it's, it's beautiful. It is beautiful. We're going to get one of these. It 
it's a it's a less than traditional um, pairing per se. You know what I mean? It's not your usual, but it's 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 a perfect combination. It's magical. Journey by Moonlight. Believe in magic. It is magical. I know that it is. Magic is all around you. Spiritual dimensions and magic and mystical realms are only a thought away. The veil is thin right now between you and the realm of fairies, elves, angels, and spirit beings. It's indeed a magical universe, and the key to opening the doors to these realms is to trust. And there's been a lack of trust, but I think it's I think it's 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 here now. Anyway. Even if you can't see, trust that you are being supported in mysterious and wondrous ways. Like I said, moving forward in blind faith. That's what, that's what I got here. Even if you can't see, trust that you are being supported in mysterious and wondrous ways. All is not as it seems. Trust your intuition in those nudges from spirit. Believe. Believe. When the traveler journeys by moonlight, mystical beings emerge and magic abounds in the depth of the enchanted forest or enchanted forest. Even through even though the traveler can't see clearly, he trusts that blessings and support are being showered over him and his life. The key to having miracles transpire in your life is to believe in magic and trust that you are supported by unseen beings in accordance with your higher good. So I feel like somebody has been divinely guided to go after their happiness. To get to know the new partner, the new person, or whoever it is that they... have been holding them back themselves back from so um, somebody is finding the courage and the confidence to move forward with blind faith and that's 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 what I got here so I hope it's for you good luck <laughs>